When someone comes to you and says, we want to help raise money for kids in Mexico, they're going to come and put on an amazing performance for you. All we need you to do is find a venue and sell some tickets. How do you say no to that? And Rotary has a mandate to do things internationally. And this is just another way that we can do that. Let's reach out and let's take some of the affluence that we have in our part of the world and let's spread it around. Everybody deserves a chance. Well, we have 90 kids at the children's home. In this program here, we have 34. And it's 50% kids from the children's home and then 50% kids from the community combined to make the dance troupe. In 2005, we began to do some programs with the ballet. We found that the young people that started with the ballet, within a period of time, they started changing their lives. Because to be in the ballet, they have to maintain their grade average high. They have to be good citizens in the community. And they have to be willing and committed to rehearse between 12 and 15 hours a week. When it started out, we thought it would just be a way for the kids to rehabilitate from some of their emotional damage and give them something to have some confidence and pride in. But they got so good at it, we were thinking, wow, we really want to share this with other people around the world. They have over 200 different movements that they have to remember. Right now, we'll be doing six different regions plus the pre-Hispanic dances. to get focused, to have a determination, a grit, and all those things that it takes in life to succeed, they're learning here in the dance program. Tell me, how long have you been dancing? Uh, nine years. And I hear you're at university now. Yeah, I'm going to finish in December. I'm going to graduate. Now you're traveling the world. This is your first time out of Mexico? Uh, no, my first time was two years ago. And actually, we performed in Peru last week. And now we are here in Canada. Mariana, you're not part of the program, but you're helping yes. in the program. How did that happen? I'm a singer, I'm an actress in Mexico. Uh, Nancy tell me, hey, Mariana, come with us to Canada. It's really great. I'm so happy to be part of this. Every young person that has gone on one of these international tours has changed their lives. They have seen there is another world. There is something out there. The world is not just Manzanillo or my small little area. Not only has it changed our kids' lives, it has changed the people who see them perform. These kids are phenomenal. They're young people that have just taken something, they have the discipline, they work through it, and each day you can see that smile just getting bigger and bigger on everybody. It's beautiful. The costumes are spectacular. But what's really fascinating is they're, they're really very professional. They're really good for their age. I like the dancing. <laughs> no dresses? Dresses doesn't do it for you? I like the swords. Would you recommend it? No. I would super recommend it. It's the best thing that I've seen in a long, long time. Viva! 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 Viva!